Good morning, Patriots. Welcome back to Rex Pines TV. I'm Elia Santiago. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I, I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for our school mission statement. We the Patriots achieve greatness through high expectations, passion, and perseverance. Thank you. You may now be seated. Today is Monday, November 27th, 2023. Now let's go to Ariel for Today in History. Thank you, Elia. What's new, Patriots? Today in history on November 27th, 1924, is the first Macy's Thanksgiving parade that was held in New York City. This was because they wanted to raise holiday sales and highlight Macy's new store. This day was important because a lot of the Macy's employees were the first European immigrants. This became an American tradition, especially known for its huge balloons, which was shown in 1927. I personally can't wait to see Stuart the Minion. Now let's go to Giselle for today's tasty lunch. Thank you, Ariel. Today's lunch is chicken tenders, turkey and cheese deluxe hoagie, potato wedges, cucumber, mandarin and oranges, and your choice of milk. Tomorrow's breakfast is bagel, cream cheese, frosted cornflakes, graham crackers, fresh orange, and 100% apple juice. Students, please note that the lunch menu can change at any time. And so always bring your lunch card. And don't forget to inform your teachers if you'll be receiving lunch today. Bon appetit! Now let's go back to Aliyah. Thank you, Giselle. That sounds delightful. Tomorrow, third and fourth graders will have their turn at the Patriot store. And don't forget that the store is only open from 7.15 to 7.55 a.m. Make sure to manage your time in order to come early. Patriots, remember to keep your phone shut down and in your backpacks at all times and there's no chewing gum in school. Please spit it out before entering the building. Last week, our brilliant Patriots had their honor roll ceremony. Let's take a look at all of them. All right, we're gonna go ahead and get started. Congratulations to these second grade students for making A B honor roll. Congratulations to our second grade students for making A B honor roll. Congratulations to our second grade students for making A B honor roll. Congratulations to our second grade students that made all A. Congratulations to our third grade students making A B honor roll. Congratulations to our third grade students making A B honor roll. Congratulations to our third grade students making A B honor roll. Congratulations to our third grade students making A B honor roll. Congratulations to our third grade students making A B honor roll. Congratulations to our third grade students making A B honor roll. Congratulations to our third grade students making all A's. that I wanted to make sure that we recognize you today. Congratulations to our fourth grade students that you made the honor roll. Congratulations to our fourth grade eight honor roll students. Congratulations to our fourth grade eight students. Congratulations to our fourth grade honor roll students. Congratulations to our fourth grade honor roll students. Let's give a huge round of applause to Let's give our fifth grade students a great round of applause to Amy Arnold. Congratulations to our fifth grade, Amy Arnold. Let's give Riley a huge round of applause. Let's give a round of applause to our sixth grade students that made the honor roll. Let's give a round of applause to our sixth grade students that made the honor roll. Congratulations to our sixth grade honor roll students. Congratulations to our sixth grade students making the A B honor roll. Congratulations to our sixth grade students that made all A's for quarter one. Excellent job, thank you. Congratulations to our seventh grade students that made the A B honor roll. Excellent job, thank you. Let's give a round of applause to our seventh grade students that made the A B honor roll. Congratulations to our seventh grade students that made first A's for quarter one. Job well done, thank you. Congratulations to our 8th grade students that made AP on the road. Job well done, thank you. Congratulations to our 8th grade students that made AP on the road. Good job, thank you. Congratulations to our 8th grade students that made AP on the road. Good job, thank you. 
Let's give a huge round of applause to our eighth grade class for this wonderful Congratulations to all our students. Thank you to our parents and guardians for coming out and the hard work you are doing at home as well to help students succeed. Great job, everyone. Congrats on getting honor roll, and don't forget that there's always next quarter. Do you like to have fun? Well, if you fundraise for our epic sports, you get to have the most fun ever with friends at the Color Run. And it's going to be a super fun day. In order to get in, all you need to do is fundraise $40 on the website. It will be held from December 14th to December 15th. Who wouldn't want to have the best fun day before Christmas? In addition to a super fun day, we are having the ugliest sweater party ever. It will be held on December 15th from 6 to 9 p.m. And the fee is $15 plus a meal. And for whoever has the ugliest sweater, they get to be crowned the Cozy Christmas Champion. Will you be the winner? Don't fret, Patriots. If you missed the high school fair due to bad weather on the 16th, well, you're in luck because the fair has been moved to December 20th. Just make sure to not miss this day. The time has arrived. Testing is back. And for today's testing grades, Kinder, 3rd, 4th, and 5th will have their reading NWA. And then first graders will have their reading NWA on the following day. I hope you all are ready and make sure to study. Lastly, our boys soccer team will have a game at Jewish Academy at 4 p.m. Let's wish them luck and hopefully they didn't forget to practice over their break. Now let's shine on Nia for today's weather. Thank you, Eliya. Hey, Patriots. Today's weather is... Everyone in a fly? Now to reality. Our favorite TV shows just like The Jetsons and Back to the Future have predicted this car. This car completed its first flight in Washington, D.C. You need both a driver and plane license in order to drive or fly this vehicle. The Playmobil can fly at 450 miles and speeds up to 200 miles per hour and can fly as high as 13,000 feet. And you're not the only one that wants this car. Over 2,300 people all over the U.S. want to drive this. You pick this over a Bugatti? Then let's wish our Patriots happy birthday with Catherine. Thank you, Nia. Today's birthday girl is Abigail Patterson. And her belated birthdays for Friday and Thanksgiving are... Happy birthday, now let's go back to Eliya. Thank you, Catherine. Patriots, here are your past expectations. It represents, present yourself positively, act kindly towards others, treat the school's environment respectfully, and succeed at everything. Congrats to Miss Sands, Miss Jordan, and Miss Cher for getting the correct answer to Thursday's daily challenge, which was, what is the fifth zodiac sign? The correct answer was a Leo. And today's daily challenge is, Daily Challenge. What blood type is a universal donor? Teachers, please send your answers to pines.renaissance at gmail.com before 9 a.m. in order for your answers to be reviewed. Winners will be announced on the next morning announcements. Everyone at IPTV would like to wish you all a magnificent Monday. Have a spectacular day!